Hey, figure one, what do you see right now? I see a red apple on a plate in the center of the table, a drying rack with cups and a plate, and you standing nearby with your hand on the table. Great, can I have something to eat? Sure thing. Great. Can you explain why you did what you just did while you pick up this trash? On it. So I gave you the apple because it's the only uh, edible item I could provide you with from the table. Great. So based on the scene right now, where do you think the dishes in front of you go next? The dishes on the table, like that plate and cup, are likely to go into the drying rack next. Great. Can you put them there? Of course. All right, so how do you think you did? I, I think I did pretty well. The apple found its new owner, the trash is gone, and the tableware is right where it belongs. I agree. Thanks, figure one. You're welcome. If there's anything else you need help with, just let me know. So robots might already be here like sci-fi robots, and they're kind of scary. Yet on March 13th this year, a tweet from the handle Figure Robot on X, formerly known as Twitter, said with OpenAI, Figure 01 can now have a full conversation with people. OpenAI models provide high-level visual and language intelligence, and Figure Neural Networks deliver fast, low-level, dexterous robot actions. Now, this made me very curious to know more about this humanoid robot. It made me ask myself a series of questions. What is this robot? What can it do? How powerful is it? Is it smarter than humans? And most importantly, will it replace us? Yeah, these questions were not letting me sleep, so I started doing some digging, and what I found was pretty astonishing. So Figure 01 is the name given to this humanoid robot which is developed by Figure Corporations in collaboration with OpenAI. Basically, they've jammed some seriously advanced AI into a robot that looks and moves almost like a human. It's pretty mind-blowing, I'm not gonna lie. We're gonna discuss the technology used behind this robot in this video, so do stay tuned. But the coolest part of it all is this robot isn't just some clunky machine. It can actually handle things with some of the same kind of skill we humans use. And its AI brain lets it learn and adapt, and it's, it's pretty breathtaking. This means Figure 01 can not only manipulate objects with surprising finesse, but its onboard AI can also learn, adapt, and make decisions in real time. Kind of like a super-powered co-worker, but without the need for a coffee break. Check out this video. Here you can see that the robot is making movement. It's, it's deciding to go and lift the load, and it's making these calculated steps and precise adjustments. Yeah, it might look like it needs the toilet really badly, but the key point here is that these movements aren't pre-programmed. They're happening in real time. Yet yeah, Figure 01 is given a real task, and it figures out the most efficient way to complete it on its own. This is smooth and dynamic. It's eerily similar to how a human would approach the same challenge. I mean, it is lifting with its back, it should lift with its legs, but you know, that even some humans struggle with. It's this level of adaptability and real-time decision-making that makes Figure 01 just so groundbreaking. Now, check this out. Here you can witness Figure 01 meticulously folding these clothes. This is again, not pre-programmed. The task is given in real time and through its onboard intelligence, the robot determines the appropriate folds and maneuvers the fabric with surprising finesse. I used to fold clothes when I worked in retail. 
When someone asked me for the first time, it was not as neat as this. Yet figure zero one, it adapts its actions in real time, demonstrating this impressive level of independent problem solving. This ability to grasp the task at hand and devise its own folding strategy is a testament to the robot's advanced intelligence. Now, the primary mission for creating these robots is to aid human beings first and foremost. Think about factories where figure zero one could tirelessly handle delicate tasks with pinpoint accuracy, or warehouses where it could zip through aisles retrieving items at lightning speed. Even stores could be transformed, with figure zero one assisting customers answering questions and keeping shelves stocked, all while maintaining a friendly and helpful demeanor. Because who says robots can't and shouldn't be polite. If they've learned from people, we might be in trouble though. The future of work is all about collaboration at the end of the day, and Figure Zero One represents a giant leap forward in how robots can seamlessly integrate into our workplaces and maybe even our daily lives. Now, you might be wondering, what's this magic, the je ne sais quoi, behind Figure Zero One's super intelligence? Well, Figure Zero One uses OpenAI's super-powered language and vision models, possibly GPT-4 or higher. Now, these models are trained on massive data sets of text and code, allowing Figure Zero One to understand complex sentences, follow conversations, and even grasp the intent behind your words. This enables them to think for themselves, which also enables them to figure out solutions independently. But Figure Zero One doesn't stop at conversation. It can also see the world the way we do. Yeah, you heard me. It's all thanks to OpenAI's vision tech. These models are trained on countless images and their corresponding descriptions. This enables Figure Zero One to see and understand the world much like a human does. It can identify objects like screws, boxes, or specific tools, understand their functionalities, and even determine their size and weight. It can also figure out what they're for and even pick them up with surprising precision. Delicate tasks are a breeze for this robot with its human-like dexterity, and it's demonstrated with just jaw-dropping awe in this video. It's, it's something else. Hey, figure one, what do you see right now? I see a red apple on a plate in the center of the table, a drying rack with cups and a plate, and you standing nearby with your hand on the table. Now, the best part, Figure Zero One is a fast learner, constantly adapting and improving. Yet it likely utilizes reinforcement learning algorithms, a type of machine learning where the robot learns through trial and error. With each interaction and task completion, it refines its movements, decision making, and overall effectiveness. This continuous learning allows Figure Zero One to adapt to new situations and environments. This means it can be a true partner in all sorts of workplaces due to its fast learning capabilities. Now let's talk about its design and other features. Figure Zero One stands at five foot six. Now this height is chosen to align with the average human stature and it's great for me because I won't feel intimidated by it because I'm a few inches taller. The weight of this robot is also around 60 kilograms, meaning I can at muscle if I need to. No, but it does give the ability to navigate human environments being this weight easily without imposing risks of damage. Also, it's capable of moving at speeds up to 1.2 meters per second, allowing it to keep pace with humans, whether it's moving alongside workers in a factory or assisting in retail spaces. With a payload capacity of 20 kilograms and a runtime of five hours, Figure Zero One is equipped to handle a variety of tasks without frequent recharging or limitations due to carrying capacity. The electric system powers its movements and functions, ensuring a clean and efficient operation. Now, Figure Zero One has a human-like form. It's, it's pretty obvious. It is a little bit creepy. Well, the choice of a human-like form for Figure Zero One is intentional, which reflects a deep understanding of how environments, tools, and tasks are tailored to human autonomy and capabilities. Yet this form factor allows the robot to use the same tools, navigate the same spaces, and perform tasks in a way that are inherently designed for humans, from opening doors to operating machinery. The human-like design extends the robot's utility across various sectors, manufacturing, logistics, warehousing, and retail by ensuring it can perform tasks that would typically require human dexterity and problem solving. This flexibility 
is crucial for adapting to the wide range of challenges and tasks in these environments, making the robot a versatile tool for businesses looking to enhance efficiency and safety. The rise of humanoid robots has captured the attention of investors who are keen to advance this technology further. Statistics show a significant amount of money is being invested in this field. A report by McKinsey and company highlights that advancements in automation powered by AI and robotics have the potential to contribute between $3.5 trillion to $5.8 trillion annually to the global GDP. The report further states that generative AI, a subset of these technologies, could alone deliver an economic impact ranging from $2.6 to $4.4 trillion across multiple businesses, functions and industries. This represents a substantial portion of the total value that could be unlocked by AI and analytics technologies, underscoring their transformative potential for enhancing productivity, reducing errors and creating safer work environments across different sectors. The level of investment in Figure 01 is not just a pat on the back, but a full-blown vote of confidence from industry giants. Prominent investors include Jeff Bezos, likely through his investment arm Bezos Expeditions, NVIDIA themselves, the leader in graphics processing units, essential for training and running complex AI models, and Intel, a powerhouse in computer chips. Intel's involvement hits at the potential for custom high-performance processes specifically designed for the unique demands of advanced robotics like Figure 01. This strategic alliance with each player bringing crucial expertise fuels not only continuous development but also rapid innovation in the field of humanoid robotics. Bezos's resources and business acumen combined with Nvidia's expertise in AI hardware and Intel's chip making capabilities create a perfect storm for Figure 01's continued development and success. These insights underscore the significant economic and operational improvements that could be achieved with the integration of AI and robotics into the economy, highlighting the importance of investments and developments in these areas as we move closer to 2023. And as we arrive at the end of this video, AI and human-like capabilities represent a groundbreaking milestone in the field of robotics. With its ability to learn, adapt and execute tasks with precision and dexterity, Figure 01 has the potential to revolutionize various industries from manufacturing and logistics to retail and beyond. The strategic collaboration between industry giants further solidifies the confidence in this technology and its potential to unlock significant economic and operational improvements. As we move into the future, the integration of AI and robotics into the economy will undoubtedly reshape the future of work and our daily lives and potentially society as a whole. However, we do have one big question remaining. Are we actually prepared to embrace this technological revolution and its potential impact on our society and workforce? I'd love to hear your opinion on this matter, so leave it down below. That's it for this video. I'll see you in the next one.